Hello, I would be taking this NPTEL course on Foundations of Quantum Theory Relativistic Approach. My name is Kinjalk Lochan and I am a faculty at Department of Physical Sciences at ICER Mohali and following is my email address kinjalk at the rate of icermohali.ac.in. So in the course of Foundations of Quantum Theory with Relativistic Approach, we are going to cover a couple of um, few of topics which will be very relevant for the study of matter field interaction and something people are looking at with a great interest towards unraveling the structures of atomic physics or even aspects of quantum fields and how these two systems interact with each other nowadays. So in our course we will start with a review of perturbation theory for time independent classical fields that would be very relevant because we want to deal with ultimately the structure where quantum fields are talking to atomic systems. So it will be a good idea to start doing quantum theory of atoms first with classical fields. Then we will review the perturbation structure using time dependent classical fields. And once we have developed these ideas about the interactions of fields with quantum system, we will move towards quantizations of field themselves. The first stop towards that would be a brief review of special relativity where we would see what kind of relativistic principles we would need to go to the quantum domain and how do we need to modify the quantum theory to become compatible with the needs of special relativity. And in the second stop towards that, we will start developing quantum theory for relativistically moving particles and ultimately go on to discuss two sets of equations. One is Klein-Gordon equation and one is Dirac equation, which we will study and see how they are replacing the Schrodinger equation. Once we have through with the structure of relativistic particles, we will have one go at quantizing the fields as we will see that would be a thing which we would we will get at our hand which would not be avoidable that one needs to quantize relativistic particles in a field theoretic approach and we will discuss a couple of types of fields a scalar field dirac field and also vector fields as such of quantum theory of light we will study their various states vacuum state coherent state thermal states their quantum correlations and their propagator properties and vacuum fluctuations, which will become important for us. Then we'll start dealing with the central topic of the ongoing research nowadays, which is the atom quantum field interaction. And we will do so with a model of something called Unru DB detector. And there we will discuss this atomic system talking to quantum fields through monopole and dipole couplings. And we will study phenomena which is arising out of this quantum field structure into atomic physics, for example, spontaneous emission, stimulated emissions, and those kind of things. Towards the end of the course, we will see how a system talking to quantum fields, which is present in the background, even for vacuum of the field, there are vacuum fluctuations the atomic system talks to. So therefore, it is case of open system dynamics, and that would be discussed through writing a master equation for metal field interactions. And to, towards the end, we will also discuss about other aspects where quantum properties fields could be inferred out of study from atomic systems. And one central example of that would be study of entanglement through matter field interactions. So these are the content of the theory which we will uh, discuss in this course. And uh, it would be a 12 week long course. We will do exercises during the class to cover the concepts. So I look forward to this interaction with you and it will be fun to have more discussions regarding the topics which we will cover in this course. Thank you.